I come to you from Redding, California, which is a community of about 90,000 people. I would describe it as rural-ish. Uh, so, you know, even though it's 90,000 people, if you go right outside of town, you may end up in uh, on ranch or ag land, or you may end up in a national park. So that's, that's the place that I'm coming from. We have a fledgling community of civic hackers who are participating in the National Day of Civic Hacking for the first time this year. And when we looked around and tried to think of, well, what are we actually prepared to try to address as civic hackers, we're not quite at the stage where we are ready to develop an app or to hack uh, materials, you know, in a, in a um, matter stream sort of sense. But what we decided we needed to do is to try to hack the narrative of our community, so hack the story of Reading. Um, when Reading makes the news, so if you were to Google Reading, California right now, um, you would find stories that you know are on the national news just in the past couple of months, like um, Gallup did a poll of well-being of 189 different communities across the, the country, and Reading uh, made the news by ranking 187th out of 189 communities across the country. Uh, and then just to add insult to injury, just recently, uh, we made the Wall Street uh, a Wall Street Journal article about how we were ranked as the third most miserable city in the U.S. Uh, so you can start to imagine. I, I personally don't think it's the third most miserable city, but if this this is sort of what you find if you Google Reading, California, um, and we're a place that's really badly in need of attracting talent. So we're you know about three hours north of San Francisco by car. Um, so we're kind of on the San Francisco to Portland corridor. And um, we're in this transition moment in terms of industry, moving from sort of logging and mining industry to potentially becoming a hub for uh, digital, the digital workforce of Northern California. So we were imagining, well, what, what should we hack for the National Day of Civic Hacking? We really need to hack the story of Reading. And we decided to start doing that by uh, editing our Wikipedia page, getting a group of people together we looked at the you know Wikipedia for Reading, California, and we surveyed it, and we thought, huh, well, if I was if I was a you know talented young engineer, for instance, in Portland, and I was looking to move someplace, and I Googled Reading, California, I'd find you know Gallup and third most miserable city, um, but I would also find the Wikipedia page, and I'd probably check it out. Um, so we surveyed our Wikipedia page, and decided that would be a good. Um, a good thing that we could tackle just in the course of an afternoon for the National Day of Civic Hacking. If you look at our page, we have, um, just to give you a sense of what you might encounter, there, um, there you might find a description of the Cascade Theater, for instance, which is this lovely Art Deco renovated theater that's in the heart of our downtown that's in the, in the early stages of a real revitalization. Um, but you would also find four times more by word count about an anecdote in our history of uh, a historic lynching, which which features prominently on the Wikipedia page, and so we were, you know, the, a group of us were sitting around saying, "Shouldn't someone do something about that?" And we realized, okay, well, Wikipedia, anyone can author it, anyone can edit it, edit it, so we should just undertake that. So our event is coming up this weekend. We have a small group of um, coders and creatives and writers and developers who are going to assemble. Um, all of whom are community-minded, fledgling civic hackers. Um, and we thought, well, what can we accomplish in the course of three hours? So we're, we're going to look at the Wikipedia page and take an additive kind of approach. So as we scan it, we really ought to be added that objectively uh, would reflect some of the vital activity that's happening in our, in our community so that we might just begin to change the narrative. Um, so let me just kind of open source our agenda. This will be my last thing, um, what we're aiming to do. First, we're going to start by building a literacy of the commons in the group. So we're going to share the five pillars of Wikipedia, just to bring everyone up to a shared perspective about how Wikipedia operates and how we can be good citizens of Wikipedia. Um, we have a, a local person who's a former Wikipedia administrator. So from his experience, he's share with us about how to get smart around authoring and editing a Wikipedia article, just give us some advice about that. We have a section where we're going to co-create a vision for how to hack the narrative of Reading. Um, so this will be you know, rapid fire sticky notes where we'll start to cluster the kinds of things that we want to add to the Wikipedia page. Uh, we have a process where we're going to check our bias because after all, Wikipedia is an encyclopedia and so we want to make sure that we're being 
objective. You know, in Wikipedia language, we want to avoid puffery or sort of this peacock syndrome of saying, this is the best thing about our community. So we want to check our bias and do that in quite a disciplined manner. Then we'll actually make the edits uh, to the Wikipedia page. And finally, we will acknowledge that it's the nature of Wikipedia that the work that we're putting together for our National Day of Civic Hacking event may get undone. Others will continue to edit it, hopefully build on it. Uh, but it may be undone by you know the evening after our event. And isn't that kind of the way that community operates, actually? Um, so this is that's our, our experiment. And it's early stage. We're learning a lot as we go about how to do this. And uh, we'll be sharing the, the National Day of Civic Hacking is gathering stories from after the event. So we're going to make an intentional effort to share that out and give people visibility into how it goes. Thanks for having me. Excellent. Thank you, Rachel. Looking at the wall the whole time. So I'm going to see if this is, if I don't break anything. Oh, gosh. oh cool. I'll take a screenshot of who I'm I am. do a little bit of, well, there's wait, are you see people? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Thank Thanks. You. Great to be with you. Thank you so much.